Hey everybody, I'm the Pigglesworth, and welcome back to Antimatter Chemistry. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> I have to keep looking, looking at the uh, title of the mod before I start. Look at this. It's just growing. It keeps going. That is so awesome. Why can't you guys do that? Or you? Why can't you just keep growing infinitely upwards and then we can have like an infinite amount of stuff in a small spot? That would be cool. <laughs> so I've emptied out some more down there and started processing a whole bunch of stuff through here. And we've managed to get a few more items in there and they're starting to fill up big time. So that means eventually we're going to have to start building some storage upgrades if we want to hold more stuff than what we've got in here. But in the last episode, I left off saying that I was going to process all this stuff off camera because they wanted 80 of them. And I'm like, yeah, that's going to take a few minutes, which it did. It took me, I don't know, maybe five or 10 minutes of just running stuff through and processing. The potassium chloride was actually a whole lot easier than I thought it would be. Let's look here. Potassium chloride can come from mineral salts and then these blocks, which I've yet to see. So all I did was I just kept running uh, buckets of water in these little evaporators and then running the mineral salts through and it gave me m all of the, uh, whatever that element was, all of it that I needed. So let's see here, it looks like, Okay, that one I haven't grabbed 80 of yet, I was going to say, because it's not showing as um, blue. So let's go ahead and put two back. There we go. So that should be, yep, okay, awesome. So we'll get iron sharpening kits here. Wait a minute, I've got, hmm, maybe I have to be holding it. So potassium chloride, aluminum oxide, and magnesium oxide. So... That's magnesium oxide. We'll go ahead and put one of those back so we keep that spot. Magnesium, potassium, aluminum oxide. There we go. Let's go ahead and put, put some back there. So will that, will that give me the achievement? Collect 80 aluminum oxide moles. I have 80. See? Will it not let me stack it? See, it won't let me stack it. How are you supposed to claim that? 60, 70, that's 80, right? I mean, I, I think I'm doing my math correct. I don't understand that. It, and it won't let me click that. Is there some kind of a, a glitch or something here? It says I have 64 out of 80. That is so weird. I can't hold more than 64 in one stack. Well, great. <laughs> All right, so I'm, I'm going to have to make a quick edit here. I'm going to have to go do a little bit of uh, of uh, research. You know, let's do this. Wait. What? By looking in a chest, it gave me all of those. I was going to just put them in a chest and see if having them combined here was going to register. Like maybe not, maybe having them here for some reason doesn't register. Having them here in your inventory doesn't register. That is so odd. So we've, we've made those. Okay. Well, I don't have to do an edit. So we'll get an iron sharpening kit here. Figure out what this iron wand does and two blocks of coal. I am so tempted. It's like with the blocks of coal, I almost want to run everything through there. Let's see here. U for use in a dissolver gives me carbon. And then what did we just click on? Nothing over here. Okay. So we can make carbon out of it. We have a ton of carbon. We might be able, let's do R for recipe. No, I don't see it. I was going to say maybe there's a way Liquefied coal, liquefacted coal. Okay. I was going to say, if we can dissolve it into carbon, I wonder if we could compress carbon into that, but maybe not. So let's see here. We've made all of these. We can go make obsidian, but the first thing I want to do is make this wooden energy. Craft two furnace generators. Tartar sauce. I only made enough material for one. 
So we will have to come back to that because I've got nine ingots. It takes 16 of these to make an ingot. 16 times 9 is, is uh, let's see, 9 times 10 is 90. 9 times 6 is 54. 54 plus 90 would be 144. So I'm, I'm a little more than halfway there. And let's see. Um, let's check here. Iron is coming from... I'm wondering if I was getting it from minerals. Yeah, we're getting it from mineral salts. So I'll do, I'll do that. I'm sorry. I thought I was prepped and ready. I will keep filling these up and get enough stuff for the, the next episode. So Iron Wand... What do you do? Horizontal fluid, max nine blocks. Fluid stop? Can I shift and right click? That doesn't seem to do anything. Mode horizontal. I don't understand what that does. So we're just going to, um, so we don't lose it. Because I don't know if there's a gravestone mod in this mod pack. I guess we could check real quick, right? Let's see here. Mod options. It's not. Oh, here we go. A to Z. Let's do that. And then let's scroll down. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. I thought that this was going to be a, uh, a lightweight mod pack. I hope it is. I'm not seeing gravestone. Oh, that might be stinkerish. <laughs> make sure not to die here. All right, so let's see here. We want to make 10 obsidian. And that's going to give us a diamond pickaxe, obsidian breaker. Right click an obsidian block while holding this item, item to instantly harvest the obsidian. This item will be consumed. So we get 16 of those. Are we going to run into obsidian somewhere? We'll need to collect it. Now I also need to figure out where in the world do we want to put a portal. I want it to be just far enough away. I don't have to hear it. But I guess the first step would be we need to make obsidian, right? So let's see here. I've got I've got you bookmarked a chemical combiner. So let's select the chemical combiner and then obsidian and then we will say move items. Now we need 10, which means we need 80 of these and 240 of these. I think I've done my homework. We've got 80 of these and 240 of what? Silicon dioxide. Are you silicon dioxide? Yes, you are. Awesome. Two, three, four. That should get us close to the amount we need. So let's see here. Let's just dump stuff in there. I was going to say, and it should start uh, making this stuff for us. There we go. I was like, why won't that take that? You go in there. I think we got enough power. Uh-oh. Now, what? I guess we had a little bit of leftover... Aluminum oxide? Let's see here. Oh, there we go. Ice bucket challenge. Oh, that's coal. <laughs> I'm like, why do we have separate? So, okay, good. So we got the obsidian. So let's right click you and that'll dump all that stuff back in the sorting system. Awesome. And let's see here. So from here, we want to claim our prize. Yes, we do. And then what is this? Come back. Uh, set home, forward slash set home. Now would be a good time to use the set home command before you wander away from your base. Cool. Let's do that right here. Forward slash set home. Home set. Now this was something that um, I've used whenever I've played on like uh, public servers. Sometimes you get that command set up and you can set warp points and then you can... So like if we come over here and type the word forward slash home... Whoop. It takes us right back here, which is awesome. So I, I I don't think we'll go exploring here because I get the feeling that this is just a big, vast, open uh, world. But I also get the feeling that if we put a, uh, a nether portal right here, one, two, two, three, four. I don't like how that fence combined, but it is what it is now, right? Two, three. Uh-oh. It's three high, right? I think so. And I don't want to waste one of those obsidian breakers. They're like, yeah, Peggy, we knew you were going to place something wrong, which is why we put one of those there. 
Let's go ahead and do that. I know everybody's losing their mind because we're not filling in the corners. It's okay. Just don't look. <laughs> and then we need a flint and steel. So I was looking this up. Flint is three silicon dioxide, which I think we have. I think we just used that, actually. Can you imagine if you had to play Minecraft normally this way? That would get crazy. Uh, flint. Do that. That's our Tarjay, and we'll dump that in there, and there we go. We get our flint. It's a good thing I made some iron. Flint and steel. Yes, I do. And let's see here. We light you. Kapow! All right. So let's, uh, let's see. Okay, I've got some food. That's important. Always important to a pig to have some food. And um, we have to be on the quest book. That's what it is. Okay, so we need to go and click that and get that completed. Go to Hades. Make another portal and go in. Your second dimension. And we get 4K ME storage cell and a 4K storage disk. But we still don't have a steady source of power. Or if we do, I'm unaware. So, you know, I'm really thinking maybe we should make a sword. At least a cobble sword. We don't have any kind of sword. And we need a way to defend ourselves. I don't want to use iron because um, it's taken so much to make the iron. Did I use up all... Where's the rest of the cobblestone? There it is. And I only needed one stick. Hello, Peggy. Just one stick, not two. Okay, good. So we got ourselves a sword as well. So let's hop through here and see, have they altered or changed the nether dimension the way that they've altered or changed the overworld? Is it going to be like crazy weird looking, um, what do you call it? Crazy weird looking, uh, I can't even think of the word. Ooh, there's ores here. That will definitely come in handy. That blue stuff, I think that's cobalt. And then I see some uh, some nether quartz, so that's good. So this might finally be a place where we could start mining out. What are you? Ardite? Okay, cool. I recognize some of this stuff. So let's do this. Let's go over here where we're semi-safe. I'm not hearing any ghasts yet. And let's go ahead and collect our reward. Wait. Choice reward. We have to choose one or the other? Hmm. Let's go with the ME. I think that's the one I was leaning towards was um, using ME, which I still for the life of me cannot remember what that stands for. So dig up a stack of soul sand. Oh, no. Kill 16 zombie pigmen. Kill piggies, which you can get loot crates and rotten flesh from. You can also get gold from them as a plus. So we can get loot crates. Dissolve rotten flesh to get its protein. Okay. Ooh, and then we can make a hang glider and get XP for some reason. <laughs> so let's see here. Here's what I'm worried about. Is this going to be the normal mechanic where if I kill these pigs, they're going to rush me? What 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 was... Oh, by clicking it, showing progress. That's what it is. I'm worried about are they going to be able to rush me? And so we're going to end up with a bunch of hostile zombie pigs. Hmm. There's a bunch of gravel there. I'm really not seeing... Is that soul sand? Oh, I hit C and that did this? I wonder what that's about. Oh, yikes. That's a drop off and a half. See, I'm not seeing soul sand. So that might take a little uh, exploring. No. Oh, that's fire down there. We might need to turn up the uh, render distance. Let's... Let's explore for just a moment and put this fire out just because I'm a klutz and we know what happens with klutzes and fire. <laughs> if their name is Piggy, all kinds of terrible things happen. Okay, there is a little bit of soul sand, but I need a stack. So I think what I'm going to do is between episodes, oh, oh, there's soul sand right there. Do we have a shovel with us? No, we don't, which means I'm going to have to dig that by... Oh, wait a minute. But we have ore, ore, vein miner, right? Let's 
Let's see, very carefully, let's hop down here. Great, I knew that was going to happen. Hurt yourself, not me. Hurt you? No, not me. <laughs> Alright, so let's see here. Can I... Oh, that was awesome. Let's just do that again. Now, is it taking hunger when it does that? Oh, yeah, it did take a bit of hunger, didn't it? Okay, cool. So we've got that achievement. That was easy. <laughs> Let's go in back up here, and we'll make like a little safety zone around the portal. And then we'll uh, we'll anger some zombie pigmen and get them to attack us. Oh, man, I'm like half tempted to gather some of this stuff. I may, I may do that off camera as well, just like a little nether run, run through here and uh, gather up different things. Oh, nice. These level up. That's another thing Miss Piggy does. Whenever she gets a uh, Tinker's Construct, she always gets the little plug-in or added uh, bonus mod that like lets you level up your tools. I know some mods won't let you do that. So that's what that little thing is. And it's funny, every time I hear that ding, I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. Tartar sauce. I knew that was going to happen eventually. <laughs> a grave's key. Wait, what? Ghostly shape? For a minute. Let's do this. Let's be safe and take a block to place where the lava is. So does this let me stay as a ghostly uh, thing that can't be hurt or attacked? Let's find out. And we got a key. Okay, cool. So we do have death markers. That's good. That is always good to know. Oh, I could have... You know what I could have done? I could have typed set home or just home and gotten out of there. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, there is a gravestone. So let's see if we can get hurt. Yes, we can. So even though we are ghostly, we can still burn. Oh, it put me on top of the roof. That's funny. <laughs> so let's see here. I'm going to take a block because what I want to do is I want to plug up that lava. We'll get our stuff from our grave and then we'll come back home. And then we will go through the portal from there. Look at all them deaths. Piggy just dies over and over again. See, I'm still a ghostly figure. It shows me that icon. But it tricks you. Don't believe it. Don't think it makes you invincible at all. All right, so... That? There we go. That'll get rid of the lava. And all you zombie pigmen, you're just waiting to get smacked in the face. So, how do we use this? If I squat and right-click... Oh, there we go. Awesome, that worked. So let's do forward slash home, and away we go. Nice. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so we get iron sharpening kits for that. Got warts. Gather eight nether warts with no reward in sight. Is there a way to make nether warts? Chemical combiner, cellulose, germanium, and selenium. Hmm. Can we put in, okay, cool. So we can make, so if we find some nether wart, we'll be able to do that. So that's another thing. I'll probably have to do that off camera as well, is just search around the nether, do a nether run so that I'm gathering up a whole bunch of uh, materials. And um, when I find some nether wart, gather that, and then we can bring it back and um, do that as well. I'm really curious. I'd like to do like an even number. Ooh, silicon dioxide and thallium? That's new. Silicon and oxygen. Thallium. So we got something new we can add in there. Wait, can we, let's do, um, it almost makes me think of like, there not there something on YouTube called Will It Blend? I noticed silicon. Let's do, whoa, that was a whole bunch of stuff. What are you? Gold, sulfur, zinc oxide. Awesome. So I need to gather up a whole bunch of netherrack as well. 
we can get that going. So let's see here. What what else we got? What else we got? We got a few minutes left in the episode. We want to kill some zombie pigmen. Like you do. Crazy Piggy actually is going to kill some zombie pigmen. So the first thing I want to do is let's build like a little, uh, let's build a safety pen. A pig pen. <laughs> we want to build like a little safety spot around, oh, you know what? Let's see here. Letter J will bring up journey map. Let's go ahead and get rid of these two. There we go. And let's gather up some of this. And we're going to build like a little makeshift room. I wish I had uh, doors, but I don't. Okay, good. That, sh that should be enough. So what we want to do is we're just going to block this off so that zombie pigmen can't run through here. Now, if a gas shoots at that, it'll blow it up. So we may have to fix that with cobble later on. Great. I'm not seeing zombie pigs. Zombie pigs. Zombie pigs. Just go ahead and do the corners because I have died from mobs through corners before and it's not fun. Ever. <laughs> okay, we'll prep this. Get that ready. And what I'm going to do is dig a little trench and this way we can kind of stand down here and swipe at their feet um so let's do that nope 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 we'll do that that will that way we can do that and still back up there we go that'll work kind of overdoing it here we're overthinking a little bit piggy <laughs> of course no lava no lava we don't want any lava to Okay, so we can run through here and we'll smack a block right there real quick. So what we got to do is find us find us some zombie pigs. That's crazy. There was a whole bunch of them. And now that now that we're looking for them, there are none. You know what? We need to take some of these with us because that's plant life and it's quite possible that we can get those growing in the overworld and then it's quite possible that we can um process those and end up with something really cool let's see here how is it that there's oh there we go hey you but you're all the way down there let's run over here and see if we can find some more this is the problem with just running normal in the nether because you've got so many different areas oh there we go okay so now he's up and at him so you get angry that's what I said. Get angry. Follow me. <laughs> you can't catch me. No, you can't. No, you can't. Mm-hmm. Now, I know that... Uh-oh. There we go. I know that they've reworked this mechanic in uh, 114 Minecraft. Ooh, loot box. Nice. Another loot box. And that was it. Now we have to go find some more. Let's see. Two loot crates. Give me the loot. And how many did we need? You know what? Episode's starting to run a little long, so this is what we're going to do. Let's go ahead and go home. We'll explore the stuff we got. And then I will do all the mundane stuff off camera. So we got rotten flesh. What did it, what did it say to do with rotten flesh? I keep wanting to hit the uh, the grave key to make it bring up. No, no, wait. This essence of animals. Collect protein. Protein. Uh, chemical dissolver. There we go. How much did we have to get? And how much will rotted flesh give us? It'll give us three protein. It's back out of there. And we need eight. So I'll have to do that off camera as well. Let's let's go ahead and run it through there just so we can see the process happen. Three protein, and it's getting held down there, which is awesome. We'll sort it out in a little bit. And let's go ahead and open up these. Oh, we got to get this uh, storage disk over here as well. You go right there. Thank you very much. So loot crates. Oh, we just click it and get oh, rubidium and zinc. Okay. Zinc and sulfur. Zeke, sulfur, and rubidium. I don't think we have any of those. 
Do we have zinc? Okay, we have zinc. So we can do that. But this rubidium and this sulfur is new. And we've got gold. Let's see, U for use on a gold nugget. Can we chemically dissolve it? Oh, it'll give us gold. Okay, cool. So we've got another element as well. Awesome, awesome. Wrong thing. Tried to put it in the... Uh... <laughs> it's not food, Piggy. You don't eat gold. Wait a minute. Oh, we already got gold from Netherrack, didn't we? Whoop. Oh, and it wants... Uh, it looks like it wants an even amount. Either that or it's like a percentage... If you if you do it, it's a percentage that it drops. I don't know. Awesome. So we've we've got some more progress going, which is really really cool. So in between episodes, what I'm gonna try and do is kill some more zombie pigmen so that I can get myself uh, 16 kills and get myself enough rotted flesh to do essence of animals. Um, scoop some lava. That'll be easy. I'll scoop lava while I'm at it, and that'll give me some more netherrack. We'll gather up some netherrack so we can run that through the system. I will organize all of the materials I got and get enough iron. Try and find some nether wart and get that stuff growing. And I'm going to hit A. Let's bookmark that. What does it take to make a hang glider? Glider wings and sticks. Leather. How do you make leather? Chemical combiner. Protein. Okay. So it's the nastiest protein shake you ever had. We're going to make protein from pig flesh, <laughs> zombie pig flesh to be more precise, and then we'll turn around and turn it into leather so that we can make a hang glider. So there, there you kind of know what I'm going to do in between episodes. And just so you know, I'm not really uh, reacting to any of your comments in video right now because basically I have filmed these uh, this uh, up to this point at least before I've even bothered to start editing this stuff. Like, if you go to my Discord channel, if you look and you see the little link, you can go on my Discord channel, you can find out all kinds of information about shows that I'm working on way before people on YouTube find out about it. That thing is just growing like crazy. But I've not even told people in my Discord channel I'm recording this yet. It's a big, big secret. Yeah, so, you know, don't, don't get upset if I'm not responding to your comments. It's because your comments as of this filming, <laughs> aren't even there yet. But um, eventually I know that your comments will catch up and I will address those as well. So thank you all so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, please click that like button. If you want to see more of these as I release them, you're not already subscribed, would you consider subscribing? And if you click the notification bell, you'll get notified whenever videos come out, which would be great if that's what you want. If you don't, no harm, no foul, just don't click it. But I'm going to go ahead and sort out the stuff I've got, do that off-camera uh, reconnaissance mission in the nether to get myself ready for next episode. And that's when I hope to see you is in the next episode.